Hello, dear ones. It's Alice. I'm of the stars. Um, I've heard about a, a scam just just recently on the astral plane. I suppose everybody else is probably already familiar with it, but I just had never heard of it before. It's very ingenious, and it involves a woman who wants to have a child and is married but can't afford to have the child. And it, it's really simple. It goes like this. She's a very beautiful woman, say, very alluring. Men always fall for her. But she and the person that she's been the lifelong partner of, they just don't have the money to, to, um, to get by. And um, so, so in order to have a child, she divorces him with his, like, permission and then goes on a search, like... I don't know how you say it, Craigslist search or whatever, for potential partners who have, sperm donors really, who have, um, you're probably laughing because I'm ingenuous and I don't know about this, right? <laughs> potential partners who have money and she hopes to make, uh, to marry them for, you know, a few months, however long. Maybe as long as a pregnancy, maybe less so. And get together a, like an agreement in advance that should there be issue or children that, that they'll get a certain amount of money for it. She'll get a certain amount of money for it because she intends to divorce him. And then go back to her one and only, right? And here's the kicker. The people that she's having over, she won't let them spend the night and her one and only is spending the night in the walk-in closet there in the bedroom to save money, you know. So, so it's like a scam. It reminds me of that scam where the beautiful young woman approaches a man of means or substance and, and after having uh, sexual relations with him, she turns up a few, um, a month or two later with one of those foam you know, foam pretend um, pregnancy belly strapped on and, and starts to, that once it costs $10. <laughs> and so on Amazon or wherever, someplace on the internet, and starts to, um, to get payments for child support uh, from him because of that. It's kind of, um, you might call it a con game, yeah con game. So, so there you have it. And my issue, my concern is that when I hear this stuff on the astral plane, I not get involved with it. I let people go ahead and be predators and victims, whether they be men or women that are the predator, whether they be men or women that are the victim, you know, and let them play those games so that they can learn from them because, because God will teach them what they need to know, you know, God will teach them. I can't teach them by being indignant or angry or anything like that. So, so my gig is the peaceful, neutral mind. I'm going to try that for the rest of the day. <laughs> Here I am at El Capitan State Beach. Kind of cool. And I have, I have an addition to that story. I heard just now that that con artist lady, she lines up six to eight men every time she wants to have a pregnancy, does a prenup with each of them, gets as much money out of them as she can, uh, based on issue, the, the issue that she's gonna have the, the child. Like one, she might get $50,000, another 400,000 and so on, gets money from each of them and pretends that she's married to each of them. And then after a month, divorces them and gets the money and takes the, takes the money and the child to her one and only. Isn't that an incredible scam? All right, you guys, I'm gonna go see about El Capitan. Talk to you later.